The Royal Opera House, designed by the English architect Edward Middleton Barry, the architect of Covent Garden. The theatre and the classic design plan was completed by 1861. The Royal Opera House was an opera house and performing arts venue in Valletta, Malta. It was built in 1866. The original plans had to be altered because the sloping streets on the sides of the theatre had not been taken into consideration. This resulted in a terrace being added on the side of Strada Reale, nowadays Republic Street, designed by Maltese architects. The 63-metre building with a width of 34 metres started in 1862 after what was the Casa della Giornata was demolished. After four years, the Opera House, with a seating capacity of 1,095 people sitting and 200 people standing, was ready for the official opening on the 9th of October 1866. The theatre was not to last long. On the 25th of May 1873, a mere six years after its opening, it was brought to a premature end by a fire. The exterior of the theatre was undamaged, but the interior stonework was calcified by the intense heat. It was decided to rebuild the theatre, and after the issuing of tenders for the work, and a lot of arguing whether the front had to be changed or not, the theatre was ready. On the 11th of October 1877, after nearly four and a half years from the fire, the theatre reopened with a performance of Verdi Zaida. Some 65 years later, tragedy struck the Royal Opera House once again. On the evening of Tuesday, April 7, 1942, the theatre was devastated by the Luftwaffe bombers. The next morning, experts inspected the remains of their national theatre. The portico and the auditorium were a heap of stones, the roof a gaping hole of twisted girders. The rear end, starting halfway from the colonnade, was however intact. All that remained of the Opera House were the terrace and parts of the columns.